Hello, I'm Tommy Anderson and over the coming weeks I'll be presenting a series of short how-to videos to help you get creative throughout lockdown. The activities will be straightforward, suitable for all ages and you won't need any special art equipment or materials. And this week we're going to have a go at making your own bottle top spirograph. The original spirograph was a drawing toy that children could use to create elaborate spiral artworks using two circles, one spinning inside the other. I'm going to show you how to make your own basic homemade spirograph. Some plastic bottle tops such as milk tops or pop bottle tops. Some elastic bands and a pair of scissors a roll of sticky tape and a pen. You'll also need something to draw your artwork on. So, in our aim to recycle, why not use the back of some cardboard packaging such as cereal boxes, cardboard mailers or frozen food packaging. Making your spirograph wheel is really easy. First, you need to take your milk bottle top and make a hole in it. To do this, place a rolled up newspaper or magazine onto a flat steady surface, then place your milk top face up so the way you will put it onto the milk container and hold firmly with one hand. Then use your scissors or a pen to push through a hole about halfway between the outer edge and centre of the milk top. Next you need to wrap an elastic band around the milk top. This needs to be as tight as possible without snapping the elastic band. And there you have your finished spirograph wheel. To create your spirograph artwork, you'll need to lay out the piece of cardboard you're going to draw onto. Place the spirograph wheel face down inside the roll of tape so the other way up to what you would put it onto a milk container and make sure that it's touching the inside edge of the roll of sticky tape. Then with one hand hold the roll of sticky tape firmly and with the other hand put the nib of the pen inside the hole in your spirograph wheel. Then using the pen carefully move the spirograph wheel around the inside edge of the roll of sticky tape and you'll see your pattern beginning to form. Continue this until the pattern looks even and there's your first spirograph artwork. You can try experimenting with different size plastic tops and different positions for the holes to get endless variations of the spirograph pattern. If you have some colored pens, pencils or felt tip pens, then you can draw a few different layers onto the same pattern using different size plastic tops and different hole positions to create more detailed spirograph artworks. Or you could just overlay different patterns randomly on a piece of card to create an artwork with lots of texture. And there you have it, of homemade spirograph artwork. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed making your own bottle top spirograph and I look forward to seeing all the great artwork. So until next time, stay safe and look after each other.